healthvids.com we've been getting a lot of emails from our users uh, with spyware problems. Normally we specialize in helping people with uh, their OS or uh, Microsoft uh, products, uh, Office, Excel, PowerPoint, Adobe products, Flash, Photoshop, etc. But with a huge number of emails we've been getting on spyware we wanted to um, provide a solution which will work with 90% of all problems. Of course, the 100% way of, of curing spyware is to uh, back up your data, reformat the hard drive, reinstall your operating system, uh, reinstall all your programs, and then put your data back on the hard drive. Um, of course, you then need to place uh, some kind of protection on, or better protection on the computer to prevent it from getting infected again. So, to start with, here's what we have to do. Uh, we have to, first of all, shut down uh, System Restore before we do anything else. So we go down to the uh, start button here. Uh, from here we go to um, uh, my computer. From here we right click it, go to properties, um, and we go to system restore. Of course I'm using uh, XP. Um, it, it's obviously a different procedure in, uh, in Vista and you can find that on helpvids.com. But uh, click on turn off system restore and then OK. The reason we switch off System Restore is because it automatically backs up data and restore points and can actually back up the, the spyware as well. And of course the last thing we want to do is clean your computer of spyware and then find that you can reinstall, it will rather go back to restore points and reinstall the uh, spyware. Um, and of course at the end of this process once you've cleaned your computer of spyware, uh, switch on System Restore and it will automatically make another restore point. The reason we switch off System Restore is because it automatically backs up data and restore points and can actually back up the, the spyware as well. And of course the last thing we want to do is clean your computer of spyware and then find that you can reinstall, it will rather go back to restore points and reinstall the uh, spyware. Um, and of course at the end of this process once you've cleaned your computer of spyware, uh, switch on System Restore and it will automatically make another restore point. Secondly we need to use uh, a cleaning program. Uh, so we go into all programs here, go up to accessories, uh, we then go uh, down system tools uh, and then we go to disk cleanup. We want to get rid of all unnecessary cached files to make all of the scanning run a lot lot faster with all the programs we're going to run. Now, When you've done those two things uh, we need to start to download a few programs here. And you should know that there's no one single program that will be a solution to your problems. Um, it's necessary to use a, a variety of programs. And like antibiotics, if you use a cocktail, you get a much more potent, more powerful effect. So the first one is AdAware. Uh, if you go to uh, www.lavasoft.com, uh, from here we can uh, kind of download AdAware very, very easily. Uh, we go to the products, go to AdAware. Uh, from here, uh, we then click on AdAware Free. Uh, they always try and make you buy the uh, free, uh, the more premium versions, but of course I want to provide you a solution which is free. So click on AdAware Free, and then you click on uh, Download, which will take you to Download.com. The second program, which is very very useful, is AVG Free, and we go to uh, Free.AVG.com, as you can see up uh, up in the, the title bar here. Um, another very, very powerful um, program is SpyBot Search and Destroy. And this picks up a lot of um, malware and spyware that, that's missed by other programs. Uh, from this we simply click on SpyBot Search and Destroy uh, and then we go down to Download and then you choose your mirror. We can then go to uh, malware, malware Bytes here. We go to www.malwarebytes.org um, from here we can then download the, pro the trial version by clicking on this button here and then clicking on download uh, now on uh, download.com. Um, you might also want to, if you haven't got it already, uh, get Windows Defender. This is something that uh, users of Windows XP from Service Pack 2 onwards should have already uh, installed on their computer uh, and Windows Vista users also will have it. Um, you can go to the uh, Microsoft.com website and type in uh, Windows Defender uh, to get it, um, but you might just want to check your system already. Um, it's very good for, for prevention uh, as well as for cure. Now, when you uh, get all these uh, programs, uh, 
install them, uh, let them update automatically. Um, it's very, very important to, when you have uh, installed them is to keep clicking the update button. Don't just update it once because commonly you have to update it free, more than once, uh, which is ironic when you've just downloaded it off the internet from the uh, manufacturer's website. Um, but do just click the update button until it actually says your, your definition files are completely up to date. And it's very important that you uh, update all of those uh, different software programs. From there, what we're going to do is we're going to uh, uh, shut the computer down or restart it rather. And I'm not going to be able to show you uh, how to do that uh, for various reasons. But basically, once the first splash screen has, has happened, just keep tapping F8. It should then give you a menu uh, where you choose safe mode. Um, if you have uh, any problems, you might say you know, keyboard error, that means you pressed F8 too soon. You're going to have to wait a little bit uh, further than, than you originally pressed it. So just keep restarting the computer until you get it in safe mode. When it's in safe mode, then you run the, 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 the scans. Okay? Uh, and the reason for that is you won't be able to remove all the spyware while it's in the normal mode because some of the resources are going to be used. And please don't go through scanning everything in the normal uh, OS settings. You've got to be in safe mode uh, where you'll find that the um, uh, programs, the, the spyware programs, will work far, far more efficiently. And if you uh, start with the obvious um, adware and work through with AVG Free, with SpyBot, uh, you'll find that adware takes a lot of them out. And then you'll find uh, some of the other programs will find additional um, bits of spyware which you don't know. And of course, you don't know which one is causing the big problem on your computer. And you're going to find probably multiple uh, versions of spyware on there. Um, so keep working through all of those programs obviously restart the computer into normal mode and uh, from there like I say you should find 90% of the time that your problems are solved uh, if not you're going to have to do the obvious reinstallation of the operating system uh, but make sure you obviously back up your files and then make sure you set in in motion some better protection to stop yourself from getting infected again